来了。Hello, how are you guys doing today? My name is Adam, and today we've got a live Pokemon Oras Wi-Fi battle for your viewing pleasure. This time against Oscar. Thank you so much for appearing on the channel today, Oscar. Your support is very much appreciated. There'll be a question of the day at the end of the video. I'll remind you that the like button is a thing that exists that you can make your mind up about what to do with it at the end of the video after watching, of course, or you could be a complete. And utter rebel, and hit the like button right now, and I would be completely stoked with that. You can do whatever you want. <laughs> that would be super, super cool, though. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is uh, hit battle start, and party Pokemon, and so on and so forth. Oh, by the way, Oscar's Twitter link will be in the description down below. So be sure to go and check him out if you are um, enthralled by his performance today. So. Are you? Are you? Let's turn off this noisy heater, shall we? Yes, yes, yes. So, hit Mon top. Oopsie. Maltwez. Um, Clawitzer. <laughs> Clawitzer is just funny. Uh, what's it called? Electros and Burnett. Oh man, I hate those things. I hate them because they always kill something. That's all they do. They just always have to kill something. Anyway, lads, let me let you know who I brought. I brought Forever Alone, the Clawitzer. Thank you so much, Giovanni, for giving him to me. I do think he's hilarious. I was so excited to use him. We brought Clicker, the Durant, Reese, the Dewblade, Celine, the Beauty Queen, the Explow, Jolteon, well, Sprite, the Jolteon, Burps, and Holly, the Dridagon. So, sort of hyper offensive -y, really. We're not like overly massively. I mean, I mean, we are pretty threatening and powerful. Uh, <laughs> uh, but to be honest, I actually have a really good matchup by just leading with my Drudagon, so I think we're going to do that. Yeah, let's just lead with Drudagon and just go for it, really. Uh, my Drudagon is a para-shuffling like nuisance, basically. There's no heal bell on the team, which is pretty sweet. Just intended to like um, just paralyze the team and slow everybody down for like my beautiful Clawitzer to go and fuck things up, and the same with beautiful, resplendent um, Celine as well. So out comes Barbara. <laughs> I don't like you very much, Barbara. Barbara, you're a bit scary. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go straight for the... Um you know, I actually really strongly feel like going for the Toxic because we'll be able to wear away at this thing for a bit. So we're going to go for that Toxic. As my opponent goes to the Yawn, trying to force me out, I do kind of wish I'd gone for my, for my rocks, but... Uh, on the first instance, but I'm actually just going to go for my rocks now. I'd rather, I'd much rather Holly be asleep than anybody else, and I don't want this Uxie to be able to yawn anybody else out, so I'm going to go for my rocks right now, I don't care. Um, even though I would like to para shuffle, I do find it very important to be able to get one's rocks up. I think that's very nice. So we're going to go for our rocks. I'm going to let myself fall asleep. This is so that he can't yawn out anybody else. You get the sleep claws in play. Um, yeah. So Barbara is here and going to get poisoned. Yes! Barbara, get poisoned! <laughs> so uh, hopefully Holly will just wake up and kill something. That'd be extreme. Uh, but what we're going to do now is we are actually going to go for the... What are we going to do? I want to just go for Dragon Tail because I'm kind of thinking my opponent is going to switch into something more advantageous for him. So we've seen the Stealth Rock, we've seen the Yawn. I don't quite know what my opponent wants to go for. It chooses not to U-turn if they have it. Goes into Claw it, so. so this thing screams Ice Beam. So hopefully Holly will just wake up and smack it, but I won't be surprised if not. Holly is fast asleep, so that's a bit, a bit awful. That is a bit awful. Um, Stay in home and play pretend. Where's your fucking gun your way? So uh, I am actually Spidoff. So I... I feel like going into Clicker and doing something about it, about the world. Um, Reese is a really obvious switch in. Reese is a very obvious switch in, so I think the Dark Pulse could come and hurt me in my um, unhappy place. So I think I'm just going to stay in and go for the Dragon Tail. Uh, no, he's not going to overpredict whatsoever, I'm just going to go straight for the Ice Beam. Um, we are Spidoof, so that's okay. We do manage to take that. It is Life Orb, which is very useful. Holly is still asleep. God damn it, Holly. It's okay, I know. I understand. I get it. What item do you have? What item do you have? Oh, you don't have an item, I forgot! Oh, poop. Um, 
So I could leave Holly in to die and lose a massive check to the Moltres. Oh, whoops. Should have thought about that, shouldn't I? Anyway, we're going to be able to barbecue this thing with my Jolteon either way. And the Moltres, and there's no spinner, so... You know what? I'm just going to stay in. That's just... I don't want to ris get anybody any more damage, so we're just going to stay in, go for the Dragon Tail. Hopefully my opponent ever predicts and goes to the Dark Pulse. Not going to happen. Just going to go for the safe and easy play. Uh, goes to the Ice Beam. Holly is going to die, but at least the Clawitzer is, you know, weakened with Life Orb and stuff. And we do have our Rocks up and we have Poison Deoxy. So Holly, you did your job to the, to the best of your abilities. Now we're free to go into Sprite and just fucking nuke somebody. Um, yeah. The Electros could definitely be a salt vest, and that would make me very sad. Um, I'm telling you, I could nuke somebody. Uh, hmm. So I'm quite, quite torn between going for discharge or vault switch right now. Because the Electros is a threat. Like it's a threat. Okay, it's a threat. <laughs> it's like a huge threat. I don't really have a solid means of just destroying that thing. Um, with absolutely no issues. Actually, let's have a look at Electros's speed because I think my x Cloud will outspeed it easily. Ooh, unless it's max speed or something weird like that. x Cloud, what's your speed? Yeah, we'll be fine. So what I'm going to do, actually, I'm just going to go for the Volt Switch. Yeah, just in case the Electros wants to come out, I'm just going to go for the Volt Switch. And it's my best and safest play, of course, as my opponent does bring out the Hitmon Top, who I'm guessing is... Uh, especially defensive, assault vest, something awful. Um, so let's see, there's the Intimidate. And we do go for the Volt Switch, so let's see how much this does. <laughs> We're definitely assault vest, I'm gonna say that much. Definitely assault vested, definitely assault vested. Um, do, do, do. I'm gonna go into Clicker. Uh, because, yeah, because I can just kind of murder this thing, hopefully. That would be pretty nice. I think my opponent just wants to go straight for the rapid spin. Um, I'm going to go for the iron head and hopefully try and kill this thing. I think that would be really, really nice. We are actually life orb clicker this time. We're life orb hustle. And we do land it. I think it's going to die. Yes, it's dead. <laughs> I don't think that would have killed if we weren't the life orb hustle situation. So we do actually manage to kill the hit on top. That's super, that's like a massive wall out of the way. So out comes Moltres. I don't know what this thing is after. Going to exert pressure. I don't know what kind of Moltres this is, so I do want to preserve my dear friend Clicker. Uh, my obvious switch in is my, um, my Forever Alone. My Clawitzer. Uh, this Moltres doesn't have too much left, and I do have priority on Reese. If I can set up... Who can I set up on? I can set up on the Uxie, and that's about it. I can get an SD on the Uxie, and that is literally it. So, I don't know what kind of Moltres this is. Looking at the layout of his team, I want to say it's a Scarf one, and from the way he brought it in, but it could be bluffing. I'm just going to go into my Clawitzer, as obvious as that is. Um, yeah. In before power her solar beam, I suppose. Let's go into Forever Alone. <laughs> my beautiful, resplendent Clawitzer, as my opponent does go for the safe flame for us, so that's alright. Uh, we are going to be able to see what kind of Moltres this is. I do believe it is Scarf, so that's the thing. Um, do, do, do. Hmm. So, right now, I'm going to go for the U turn, because I actually have that, so. So, mm, that over prediction is going to cost me. See what happens, guys. What happens when you predict? You can look like a badass, or it can make you look so silly. So this is this is actually fucking awful. Because um, I don't think I can kill it with a shadow sneak. Ugh. Why you do this? Why you do this? What's wrong? Why? Why do you have to do this to me? 
Why? Why do you have to do this? Why? Why did you stay in? Why would you do that? That really hurts my feelings. Um, <laughs> so that's okay. What we're going to do is go for the... Um, we're going to go for the... What are we going to go for? Let's go for the discharge. I'm sure this is scarfed. We might be able to live though. We might. We actually do! We managed to survive. We should live our life orb. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> <laughs> Why? We should live. Yes! Jolteon with 1 HP. That's amazing. So we are going to take down the Moltres. That's very, very nice. Um. <laughs> Why? <laughs> and out comes Marion the Bennett. So Jolteon is dead. Uh, and I'm guessing this thing has Shadow Sneak and whatnot. And it's going to be... A real pain. A real, real pain. Uh, what I'm going to do though is I'm going to save my Jolteon for death fodder and I'm going to go into Selene, Selene the beauty queen. I'm just going to be that guy. Save my 1 HP Jolteon. He could very well predict that and go for like a power up punch or something fucking awful and frightening. Um, but yeah, it is going to mega. These things um, annoy me from the perspective of like you have to kill them in such a particular way. Like, you have to get him with, like, a shadow, with, like, a, you know, the thing. What's the one? The thing? You know what I mean. We're just going to go for a boom burst. I don't care if we, if we get taken down with it. He is actually going to withdraw. Okay. Surprising. Not going to live. Not going to live at all. That's not going to live. It's not going to live. It's going to die. It's going to die. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's going to die. So we do actually scare out the Burnett with my x -Plowed. So that's... That's interesting. That's interesting. That's knowledge. That is knowledge. I think he was trying to sack his Moltres. <laughs> and I was like, I'm going to U-turn. <laughs> just like be like a total dickhead. I was just really excited to use... Um, what's it? I was just really excited to use my... What's happening here? To, to use U-turn. Uh, so it is going to go for the Destiny Bond after letting me kill one of his Pokemon. I'm sorry, I took down two. I was only expecting to kill one. <laughs> so that's pretty super! Die! <laughs> that's pretty nice. Okay, so down goes the Burnett. And uh, we do go down, but like, I don't care. It's fine. We managed. To, I killed more than we thought we were going to kill, so. Not sure what that was about. Not sure what, what, what that was about. So, um, I think we're safe to go into Clicker right now. Yeah. Out comes Barbara. That is Uxie. That is Uxie. Um So, yeah. That is a definite Uxie. And we are most certainly... Um, we are most certainly awake. So he can yawn if he wants to try and survive the Xs. We can miss, of course. Which we do. <laughs> the best ability in the world! Let's go for another X, I don't fucking care. Let's just do it. Hopefully we land this one. We do! And that is going to be a dead Uxie. So that's alright. The power of Life Orb. Um, I was tempted to go for a home cross there, but, I, but if he was going to yawn, I, I was going to die. So it doesn't really... You know. If he was going to yawn, I was... Um, if he'd survived... If he was going to yawn, I'd be the same outcome. Fucking whatever. So out comes Smoke. The Electros. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to leave Clicker in right now. Um. Or am I? <laughs> I'm going to go into Sprite. Yeah, let's go into Sprite. Just to see what kind of thing this is. Physical or whatever. I mean, ultimately I'm in the same spot. I am in the same position uh, with this thing no matter what happens so so let's see if it's like physical or special just for curiosity's sake so there's the knockoff um, which is absolutely amazing so <laughs> what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go into I really don't know how this is gonna go now uh, we how how oh my god Kloitzer 
might be able to outspeed this thing if it's not speed invested. I'm gonna go into forever alone and see if we can outspeed it. <laughs> oh my god, it might take it back. Uh, because of hustle missing, it might actually take it back. That's really, really depressing. Hopefully we can just land our um, our water pulse and that will be nice. Uh, not land it, I mean hopefully we can just outspeed. Which we do, so that's pretty cool. Uh, so I think, yeah, this is definitely some kind of assault vest situation right now. Uh, so. My opponent is going to go for Drain Punch. This Electros is going to try and put in all kinds of work right now. <laughs> it's going to try and go for it right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into Reese. And we should live any one hit, to be honest. We should. We really should. It should be fine. We can live one knockoff at least, I imagine. At least just the one. We're going to go for the Shadow Claw and then follow up with a Shadow Sneak. Because I don't think Shadow Sneak will kill from this range. So let's see the knockoff. We do take it. Reese is fucking rude. Um, and we're going to be able to get off the Shadow Claw. And it's going to hold on with just a poo of HP. Let's go for the Shadow Sneak now. Follow up. And that should be okay, I think. I think that should be alright. <laughs> so it happens when I try to predict sometimes. Sometimes it's really cool. Other times it just... Ooh. Ooh. Pained. Pained sound effect. Ooh. <laughs> Not nice. So that is going to be the game. A fairly close to a victory in my favour. That Electros looked like it was going to take it back after Durant missed the bloody X's. That's why it annoys me. Because that Uxie would have just been dead. And that would have just, you know, no questions asked kind of thing. But, you know, it happens. So... Yeah guys, that is going to be the game. Thank you so much, Oscar, for the challenge. Today's question of the day, because I'm prepared now. I've got it right here. Isn't that insane? You're not used to that, are you? Today's question of the day is, would you rather, right, for the rest of your life, be a duck or an owl? Right? This is like some crazy stuff, you know, because I, I, look, I saw this question and I was like, so I would you rather be like a cat or like a cat, like I don't know. It just, just didn't seem like there was a, that much difference between these things. But, but, the fact of the matter is owls are like all predatory and shit. And they're, you know, and ducks are like, <laughs> and like kind of funny. Um, but, you know, they're both cute. Yeah, they're both cute. Owls are really cute, especially when they're babies. Certain owls are cute. Some owls are really eerie. But, um... Baby owls. Owlets, is that what they're called? Are really cute. <laughs> and ducklets are so cute though. Oh no, ducklets? That's the Pokemon. Ducklings are so cute. Ducklings are too much, like they're so cute. Have you ever held a baby duckling? It's like, it's too much, man. It's ridiculous. I don't know, but based on survivability, I'd be an owl, because owls kind of kick ass. Ducks are cute, but like, people eat them and stuff. I don't really think owls are eating that much. Maybe it's some kind of delicacy somewhere. I don't know. But owls are cool. They fly around and kill shit. Woo Murderous kind of strange beasts. I don't really know. They're really cool though. Anyway folks, thank you so much for watching. Take care of yourselves and I will see you soon my friends. Bye bye!